Chapter 6 Introduction to MS Word Learning Outcomes At the end of this chapter, students will be able to Learn about word processing software Start MS Word 2016 Type and edit documents in MS Word Save and close a file in MS Word Warm up Identify and circle the softwares which allow you to change the processing of the words in many different ways. Hello! In the last class, you have learned the basic of MS Word. Now, we will discover some more features of MS Word. An overview of word processing. A word processor is a software that processes words, paragraphs and pages and is used for typing, saving and printing text documents. Modern word processing program includes features to customize the style of text, change the page formatting and be able to add header and footer, page number etc. Some examples of word processing software include Microsoft Word, WordPerfect, AppleWorks etc. Now, let us learn about a word processing software, MS Word 2016. Introduction to MS Word Microsoft Word is one of the most popular word processor programs developed by Microsoft Corporation. MS Word is the part of the MS Office package which consists of MS Excel, MS PowerPoint. It helps us to create, edit, copy, move, save and close our document. Do you know? Microsoft was founded in 1975. Let me answer. Which type of software is Microsoft Word? How to start MS Word 2016? Step 1. Click on the start button. Step 2. Two, click on MS Word 2016. Step 3. MS Word Welcome window will open. To create a new document. Step 1. Click on File option. Step 2. Click New or press Ctrl N to open a new document. Step 3. Place the insertion point at the location where you want to type the text. Components of MS Word 2016 Different components of MS Word 2016 are Quick Access Toolbar Title Bar View Buttons Zoom Control Document Area Cursor File Tab Teacher's Note Elucidate the students about electronically operated and manually operated machines. Hooray! It will be fun to change the document. Formatting the text. Formatting the text in MS Word includes changing the font, bolding the text and changing the font color and size. Font style change. It means to change the shape of the letters and numbers of a document. There is a variety of font styles available in MS Word 2016. By default, the font of a Word document is Caliber Body. Here are the steps involved in changing the font style of a document. Step 1. Select the text you want to format. To select a single word, double click. To select a line or more text, click to the left of it and then drag the cursor towards the text. Let me answer. What do you mean by font style change? Step 2. Click on the drop down arrow in the box displaying the current font style. Step 3. Now select the new font style by clicking on it. Font size Change. It means to change the size in which text appears on the screen. By default, font size by a Word document is 11. Here are the steps involved in changing the font style of a document. Step 1.
Select the text for which you want to change the font size. Step 2. Click on the drop down arrow in the box displaying the current font size. Step 3. Now select the font size by clicking on it. Font color change. It means to change the color in which text appears on the screen. By default, the font color of a Word document is black. Here are the steps involved in changing the font color of a document. Step 1. Select the text for which you want to change the font color. Step 2. Click on the drop down arrow in the box displaying the current font color. Step 3. The font color menu appears. There is a variety of colors available in the color menu. Step 4. Now select the font color by clicking on the desired color. How to save a file in MS Word? Saving a file is very important. When we save a file, it can be used later to work on it. We should always save a file before closing it. Following are the steps to save a file in MS Word. Step 1. Click on the file option available on the left top and corner of the screen. Step 2. Select the save option from the available options. Step 3. A box will appear in which you can type the file name. Step 4. Type the file name and click on the save options. Closing a file in MS Word Once you open a file, you also need to close it. It can be done by following steps. Step 1. Click on the File tab. Step 2. Select the close from the available options. It will close the document. Kids IQ Name any two font styles of MS Word. Try to copy the font and write in the same style below. Let's recall. MS Word 2016 is a word processing software that processes words, paragraphs and pages. Different components of MS Word include file tab, title bar, document area, zoom control and view buttons. You can format the text in MS Word in different ways. Formatting the text in MS Word includes changing the font color, font size, line spacing, aligning the text, etc. You can also save and close a file in MS Word. Upskill your intelligence. A. Complete the following components of MS Word. 1. File dash answer tab 2 dash area answer document 3 dash bar answer title 4 zoom dash answer control B write T for true statements and F for false statements 1 you can change the font size but not the font color in MS Word 2016. Answer False 2. Default font size is 11 in MS Word 2016. Answer True 3. We should not save a file before closing it. Answer False 4. There are only 5 font styles available in MS Word. Answer False 5. MS Word is developed by Microsoft Corporation Answer True C. Write a short note on the computer 1. What is a word processor? Give two examples Answer A word processor is a software that processes words, paragraphs and pages and is used for typing, saving and printing text documents. 2. Write down the steps involved to save a file in MS Word 2016. Answer. Step 1. 
click on the file options available on the left top and corner of the screen. Step 2. Select the save option from the available options. Step 3. A box will appear in which you can type the file name. Step 4. Type the file name and click on the save option. 3. Explain the importance of saving a file. Answer. Saving a file is very important. When we save a file, it can be used later to work on it. We should always save a file before closing it. 4. What do you mean by formatting a text? Answer. Formatting a text in MS Word includes changing the font, bolding the text and changing the font color and size. D. Tick the correct option. 1. Which of the following does not include text formatting? A. Changing font color. B. Changing font size. C. Change line spacing. D. Take the printout. Answer. D. Take the printout. 2. Which of the following is not developed by Microsoft Corporation? A. MS Excel B. MS PowerPoint C. MS Word D. Facebook Answer. D. Facebook 3. We should always dash a file before closing it. A. Save B. Edit C. Both D. None Answer A. Save 4. By default, the font size of a Word document is A. 11 B. 16 C. 23 D. 5 Answer 11 5. Title dash is a component of MS Word A. Bar B. Toolbar C. Excel D. Image Answer A. Bar Critical Thinking A. Match the following word processors with their logos Match Microsoft Excel with C Match Microsoft PowerPoint with D Match Microsoft Word with B Match Microsoft Outlook with A B there are some images provided below. Name the formatting text tool near the arrow provided. 1. Font style 2. Font size 3. Font color Teamwork A. Type your name in the MS Word app. Change the size to 23. Color it red and bold the text. Take a printout and paste below. Answer. Do it yourself.